Hi guys, today we are going to assemble Kitty and, and attach the keychain. Let's get started! Attaching the ears To assemble the kitty you will need an embroidery or yarn needle, whichever you prefer, pins to hold the pieces in place and scissors. Grab the ears, see where you want to place them and pin them to the head. I like to pin both ears right away to ensure that I will be happy with their placement. Adjust the ear if needed. Once you're happy with it, sew them in place. Thread the long tail left at the end of the ear in the embroidery needle. Insert the needle under a few loops on the head directly below the ear and pull. Insert the needle in the base of the ear, making it come out the other side. Pull the yarn. Insert the needle under some loops of the head, making the needle come out a little bit further on the other side of the ear. Pull the yarn. Insert the needle at the base of the ear, piercing through the other side. Continue until you reach the end of the ear. I like to go over the same spots one more time to make the sewing stitches look like little V's and make them blend in more with the crochet stitches. Make sure the ear is secured, finish off and hide the tail.
Repeat for the other ear. Attaching the legs. Attach the legs on the bottom of the head. Make sure to turn where you made the color changes on the legs to the center so that it can be viewed easily. I like to pin all legs to make sure I will be happy with their placement at the end. Thread the tail left at the end of the leg on the needle. Just like the ears, alternate between catching a few loops on the head and at the base of the leg. Repeat all around the legs. Go around the second time if you want or need to. Make sure the leg is secured firmly, finish off and hide the tail.
Repeat for all four legs. Attaching the tail. To attach the tail, first I find the middle between the ears and follow that spot down to the kitty's back. Pin the tail down and make sure you're happy with its placement. Adjust if necessary. Attach the tail to the body just like you did for the legs. Once you're happy with it, finish off and hide the tail. Attaching the keychain To attach the keychain you will need a long needle, invisible or grey thread and a keychain. Cut a long length of thread and thread it on your needle. Join the ends of the thread and tie a knot.
insert the needle into Kitty's head and make it come out between the legs. Pull gently making the ends disappear inside the head. Secure the thread to the kitty, inserting the needle under a loop two times to create a loop and inserting the needle into the loop to create a knot. Repeat two to three times. Be careful so that the thread doesn't get caught on the kitty's legs, tail or ears. Insert the needle in the same spot from which it came out of and make it come out on top on the center of the first round. Pull the thread adding the knots. Insert the needle into the last chain of the keychain and back into the center of the first round. Make it come out on the bottom between the legs. Pull the thread securing the keychain. Insert the needle under a loop between the legs and back into the head. Continue to go back and forth between the top and bottom, always catching a loop on the bottom and going through the last chain of the keychain until you have just enough thread to finish off or until you feel the keychain is secure.
finish off in hide the tail. Spread the tail left at the end of the head into the long needle and repeat the same steps that we made with the thread. Finish off and hide the tail.
Kitty is ready to hold your keys or embellish your bags. Thank you for watching and if you want to see more, please like and subscribe.